Well, following everything that unfolded on Monday, Scott Frost spoke with the media for the first time after firing four assistant coaches and agreeing to his restructure contract. The head coach said the last 72 hours have been rough and hard on everyone. They're hurting. Um, you know, I, I see the look on the offensive lines coach and the offensive line love Coach Austin because of the man that he is. Um, and it's the same with the uh, other positions and other groups. Uh, they're hurting. I'm hurting. Um, I've gone to a lot of games and battles and spent a lot of time with those guys. And like I said, they're, they're really good coaches and great men. Um, these are decisions sometimes you have to make as a leader. And um, the kids are resilient. They'll be okay. It's not going to be easy. I've got to find somebody that I trust. And, and it is, I'm always going to have, I'm an offensive guy. I'm always going to have something to do with it. Um, not that I didn't have the right guys. Uh, again, I can't say enough good about them. Uh, but um, I need to be able to really trust somebody. I'll still be involved, but uh, that'll take a lot off my plate and I think help me be even better in some other areas. And here are the interim coaches for the remainder of the season. Longtime NU assistant Ron Brown will coach the running backs. Offensive quality control coach Steve Cooper will lead the quarterbacks. Mike Cazano will take over wide receivers. And analyst Frank Ferducci will coach the offensive line in the interim. Coach Frost also added he is considering hiring a full-time special teams coach.